Good morning, Alexandra. Boy, our wet weather continued yesterday. Of course, we had some dry time as well, but uh, rainfall totals over the past 24 hours, uh, just under a quarter inch of rain out at the La Crosse Airport. Most spots between about a quarter inch and an inch plus, uh, especially uh, parts of Buffalo County, perhaps an inch and a half or more. Uh, but where you see these darker greens, uh, anywhere from a half an inch to an inch and a half, a little bit lesser totals in some of our eastern and far southeastern communities. But everybody saw some scattered showers and thunderstorms. Storms. Skies are mostly cloudy, but some clearing taking shape just to our west. 62 degrees at the airport and downtown. Winds out of the west northwest at 10. They'll be increasing today. And the Mississippi is rising 8.78 feet, and that trend will continue. In fact, probably rising above 10 feet here in the cross on Saturday. So those water levels will be on the high side along the Mississippi over the next uh, several days uh, from all the recent rainfall. Uh, mostly cloudy for you folks in Eau Claire, 59. The Chippewa River is high, but starting to fall a little bit, 765. Uh, current temperatures in the low to mid 60s near and east of La Crosse, uh, where that uh, humid air is being pushed to the east, mid 50s to the west in Rochester and Preston. Here's what I'm talking about about the dew points. Still in the mid 60s to our east, but some drier air, low to mid 50s for dew points moving in from the west behind that cold front. So some more comfortable air is moving in for today. It's going to be less humid with dew points generally in the lower to middle 50s. Uh, winds currently from the west at around 5 to 15 miles per hour, but they'll pick up 10 to 20, maybe gusting uh, 30 plus miles per hour in some areas to the west of the Mississippi River. So those rain showers uh, starting to shift east and out of our viewing area, and you can see the clearing line knocking on the door uh, here in La Crosse as that drier air moves in behind this cold front. Then this little uh, trough kind of extending from the main low up to the north uh, will slide through the area this afternoon, interact with the heating of the day to produce at least a chance for some hit and miss showers and thunderstorms. Sky Tracker will show that uh, dry this morning and then as we head into uh, well about after two o'clock or so some scattered showers and thunderstorms and you can see they're most widespread uh, north of La Crosse but we all have at least a slight chance. Those will dissipate early this evening with clearing skies overnight. Tomorrow uh, kind of a partly to mostly cloudy sky but mainly dry rather windy though from the west northwest and then clearing skies heading into our Friday. Outside chance for a strong to isolated severe storm about the northern third of the viewing area. Local timing would be about 2 to 8 p.m. Gusty winds and small hail, the primary threats. And rainfall uh, for today and to this evening, generally a quarter inch or less in most locations. Quick check of those high temperatures today. A little bit cooler than yesterday, about 5 degrees or so. Uh, upper 70s in La Crosse, upper 70s to near 80 in our southern communities. More of the same as we head back to the north, generally mid to upper 70s uh, in most locations. So for today, 79, breezy and less humid. Chance for some hit and miss showers and thunderstorms this afternoon and early this evening. 59 overnight tonight and then tomorrow, windy and cooler, upper 60s to around 70. Still breezy Friday, 75 and mainly dry right through the weekend with highs in the 70s. Uh, even those rain chances next Tuesday and Wednesday on the low end, generally about 20%. So Alexandra, actually much needed dry time over the next eight days. It's been a rather wet go of it the past several weeks.